Hi, Paul Stacy here on my rooftop in Vancouver, Canada. Uh, I want to give an update as well about another great project we've been working on and working really hard on. Um, this is an initiative called the Open Education Leadership Summit. It's taking place December 3rd and 4th in Paris. Uh, it's a partnership in involving ourselves, the Open Education Consortium, as well as the International Council for Open and Distance Education and the French Ministry of Education, uh, Innovate, Research and Innovation. Um, and it's really fun to be partnering and collaborating with these organizations to try to create an event like this. This event actually seeks to meet a need that there, for which there's a bit of a gap currently in the open education space, and that is there are very few events that are targeted to open education leaders. Um, there's lots of events targeted to people at the grassroots level who are creating and, and developing open education, but we thought it would be important to have events and activities that bring together open education leaders from around the world to collaborate and work together. Um, the Open Education Leadership Summit is aiming to bring together three distinct kinds of leaders, uh, one being uh, those who are at institutions or in organizations leading open education initiatives, so presidents, rectors, those kinds of people. Another group is uh, government officials who have responsibility for funding or policy related to open education, and a third group are, are the leaders of the open education movement from around the world. We're kind of trying to bring all those three people together for an event like this. Ideally, we would also get some rel relatively balanced representation from around the world. Um, and so that whole process is being done through a kind of invitation model instead of just open registration with the three partner organizations sending out invitations for people to participate. If you'd like to participate, please get in touch with us. Um, the summit is being organized as a kind of different event than a traditional conference. Instead of keynotes and presentations and plenary sessions, it's actually being designed as a hands-on interactive event. Uh, the intention here is to have people create uh, what we're calling a roadmap. And here's a mock-up I've developed for what a roadmap might look like. On the back of the roadmap, so it sort of folds like a map, uh, on the back of the roadmap are all the different uh, kinds of openness in education. So when we say open education, what are we talking about? Uh, well, we're talking first of all about open assets, which can take many different forms, such as open education resources, MOOCs, open access research, journal articles, open data, open science, and even open source so software and hardware. So those are all open assets that can be used strategically in open education. And what we're wanting to do is engage you all in mapping out how you use those and have you actually create a roadmap that identifies what you have already underway, um, what you need in terms of uh, things from within your own organization or from outside, and then have you place on this map over a kind of two-year period uh, activities and initiatives that you're undertaking to get to a particular destination that you've set for yourself. As part of defining those activities, we're going to invite you to kind of do it in a color-coded way where the initiatives are in orange, um, the open assets associated with them are in green, and the people and community parts are in yellow, and then um, how you are operating them and what your sustainability model for them are in blue, and finally, uh, what the benefits and value proposition associated with your initiatives are. So what we're intending to do is have each of you create an individual roadmap for your respective initiatives, and then we're going to uh, have breakout groups that are regionally based. And so uh, the individual roadmaps will be used to contribute to a regional roadmap that brings together the collective work of different open education initiatives within a particular region of the world, Africa, Latin America, Europe, North America, etc. And finally, on the second day, we're hoping to actually aggregate some of those and create a bit of a global roadmap that brings everybody's work together in a, in a way that serves collective interests and needs. Um, this is a really fun and interesting format. We hope you find it engaging, and we think that the outputs from this will be really constructive and lead to much more collaboration and collective uh, work in a, in, a, um, in a constructive way by initiatives within regions and between regions. Hope you join us in Paris. Um, registration information is available on our website and on the Open Education Leadership Summit website as well.
Thanks.